if you're making nineteen dollars an hour, you're probably looking at around maybe thirty-eight grand a year at the, at the end of the day. But he's making nineteen dollars an hour, thirty-six thousand dollars a year. His monthly income, so his month, the money he's bringing in monthly is about three thousand per month. Okay, and whatever his side hustle is, I don't know. We'll, we'll leave that alone. Uh, so monthly expenses, guys, you can see here, his rent's about a thousand dollars. That's pretty accurate. When you look at, uh, if you're living in an apartment somewhere, it's about $1,000 a month after you add on some, uh, some specific items. But he already has that listed here. So his water at his apartment, right? His power, cable, internet. So really just for the place that he lives, he's paying about two grand a, uh, two grand a month or close to it. But you go down here, groceries is about 250 a month. That's even kind of generous. Student loan, $225 a month. The biggest chunk that's left off of here, what is it? Taxes, exactly. <laughs> Guys, if you add on tax, this is where things kind of get kind of get hairy here a little bit. When I when I talk to you guys and you're, you know, you're talking about going straight to work out of high school, good man. I'm all about making money. I want you guys to be employed. I want you guys to make good money. But guys, there comes a time again when I say $19 an hour, and you when I, you know, when you tell me you're making that much money, and I kind of, uh, that's why I'm doing that because when you add on taxes, that $36,000 per year all of a sudden goes down to about $28,000 a year.